Big Scott, all you ever wanted, the Four Seasons. Charles L. Me. I wonder, how can a person set out in life, not knowing at all what he might do, then end up becoming something he does that becomes almost an obsession? Because he's trying to attract women? Because all the time he was never trying to do anything other than attract women? Or men? Maybe if it, he was trying to attract men, and so he would be strong, handsome, or very rich or glamorous. He might have had a charismatic personality. He might have had a great power. Or, if he had none of those, he would have gone into the arts and would have met loose women and prostitutes. Or not. Not prostitutes at all, but women who were drawn to bright colors or drugs or other um, exciting things. Late hours, <laughs> dirty talk. But he, if he could paint them, if he could bring them home, if he could have them take off their clothes, and then they would see his paintings and think, Oh my, this, this is different. Maybe he would eventually take them to bed. After a while, in spite of that, you become distracted by those bright colors. You become obsessed with those abstract things. The nature of life itself. Flat shapes. Sharp angles. And then eventually pain. Despair. Desolation. Loneliness. Hard work. Mortality. You don't remember what it was that brought you to this point. Until again, suddenly, you see a young woman. You might see her dance. You might see her step onto a tightrope because she's in the circus. And then, again you remember that all you've ever wanted was to hold her and to have her hold you. Thank you.